Hi guys, so um, I'd like to tell a story, um, something that happened about 10 years ago. I'm, I'm driving my car on the motorway. If you're in America, you'll call it a freeway, but um, I'm driving along like this, and I'm convinced that my car is leaning to one side. It's like leaning to the left. Mm, but that's unusual. Um, I've probably got a flat tire. In fact, I was so convinced that my one of my tires was flat that I got off at the nearest exit, got off the motorway exit, and found the nearest petrol station because they usually have air machines at the petrol station where you can put air in, into your tires. So I drive drove into the petrol station and I lifted up the the boot of the car, which is where we keep the spare spare wheel with a you know tire on it. Um, lifted up the boot, actually got the wheel out, and then I went to find the, the flat tire, couldn't find it, went round that side, no flat tire. I was absolutely convinced that I'd had a flat tire. Um, for whatever reason, my car seemed to be leaning to the, to the left slightly, but there was no problem with my suspension on my car. Um, just one of those things, I'd got it into my mind that my car was, yeah, that, that I had a flat tire. Um, which goes to show the, the power of the mind. We, we can be convinced of something, we can have a feeling. And that's exactly what I did. I had a feeling that my that I had a flat tire. But I must have been, I was pretty much convinced, you know, I would have bet money on it. I've had flat tires before and I know what it feels like and I just thought, yeah, it's leaning because obviously the air pressure on the left side has, has gone down. Um, but our feelings can be wrong, we can be convinced about something, convinced about ourselves, or convinced about other people, um, about good or bad, uh, I guess, but um, quite often it's, it can be a negative thing, we can, we can have a belief um, about something, but we, we, are, our, we are our minds, um, everything in our life is in there, um, in our minds. It's the control center. What goes on here um, can make our life good or it can make our life terrible, you know. And I think of it like a computer, really. I think our brains are um, like computers in a way. Of course, they're the most advanced uh, computer that you'll ever get because it's um, just the most power. Our minds are the most powerful thing, you know, that, that there is. But. Um, and if you if you have an easy life and if you have um, no problems as such, you're not dealing with depression. You don't have any issues. You don't you're not dealing with guilt or feelings of shame or whatever. Then it's then it's like owning a computer with um, that's working perfectly. Because if you've if you've got a computer and you don't have any viruses on your computer and it's not clogged up, your computer works fantastically and it, it does it does what you want it to do it can achieve a lot your computer can it can do a lot of things because it's not clogged up but if you have a mind or a computer that's um, full of um, viruses and uh, problems and issues you'll know because I've had a com I've had computers before where where they um, run really slow really sluggish because they're full and then you find out it's full of it's got full of crap on it um, I guess that's a bit of a um, an analogy, really, I'm making. Um, not sure where I'm going with this, but um, yeah, we can be conv absolutely convinced of something in life, and um, without proof, without evidence. Now, with this situation, I could prove it. I could prove that I had a, a flat tire, or actually, I didn't have a flat tire, but I could because I was visually checking it. It's a physical thing, but if it's something that's not physical, something you can't see, if, if it's a belief about yourself or something else in this world, um, it can be very powerful. It can, and, it, and it's people who are in uh, religious groups or a cult, a cult or whatever it is, they can they can be absolutely convinced of something, and it can it can um, it can rule their life, their whole life. Um, Sometimes in a positive way and sometimes not. Sometimes in a negative way. But yeah, we are we are our minds. We are what we think. And uh, thanks for watching. All right, man. Uh, I just wanna uh, I wanna thank you all for watching. You know, it's it, it means quite a lot to me. Quite a lot, you know. Yeah, that's all I can say, man.